Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. Still rolling hard in those Eden wins, man. And I'm gonna keep playing Eden until we lose, and then once we eventually lose, we will- We have the Polaroid to start, that's fucking weird. Um, but once we eventually lose, uh, I will go back to grinding out Greed and hopefully finishing him up and getting the Mega Satan kill that we've all desperately, desperately been wanting. Our stats looked pretty good. Uh, our damage is average, our range is pretty high, and it feels like our tier stat is also pretty- Pretty decent. Um, we have Diplopia to start, as well as, like I said, uh, we have ourselves. Ooh, all right, cool. Um, the Polaroid, which is kind of a weird starting item, uh, but could be great if we use it effectively. I think Diplopia gains a lot of value by being an item you start with as um, as Eden, because you're not giving up a spacebar item at the shop if you have one already. You're also not toying with the idea of spending 15 cents on an item that has the potential to be amazing, but also doesn't, it won't necessarily be amazing. But getting it for free, as with most Eden items, uh, definitely helps out big time with its value. And again, that's kind of just true of Eden items in general. They, a lot of items benefit, especially mediocre ones, generally benefit from just being in your inventory from the start that wouldn't necessarily be all that great uh, if you were to pick it up by itself. A lot of bean items come to mind that way as well. This is not worth diplopia-ing. It is, however, maybe worth using. And then we diplopia... Well, how about we do this? We take this, we grab a battery, we use it. And then we can end up diplopia-ing the... The meat. That could be good. Uh, the cube of meat or the uh, ball of bandages, whatever ends up coming first. That could be really, really good. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. We also have the opportunity to just diplopia this pedestal. But I think I'm going to hang on to that idea. And I am going to diplopia the meat. I think that's... Or, you know what? No, I don't know. We have a deal with the devil coming up. It's tough for me to swallow that as, a, as what I want to do. So, maybe I'll just take the cube of meat, not diplopia it and gamble with uh, with this. So we could take, uh, we could diplopia this, take, um, take Book of Revelations and gar almost guarantee ourselves a level three whatever, which is definitely probably worth it, if I'm honest. Oh man, there's two very good options here that I, I have the opportunity to take and I don't know which one I want to take. <sighs> level three bandage girl, I I, just, I assume she does the same amount of damage as me, boy. I actually, I'm not gonna lie, I meant to skim by it and look like a badass <laughs> by walking by it and being like, I'm not gonna take it. Instead, I accidentally took it. Oops. Well, it is what it is. I'm gonna take it. You know, as an orbital, it's still a very good pickup. There's no question about it. Um, we'll see how it ends up working. I think. Who knows, we might end up really, really happy that we did not end up diplopiaing it, depending on what we get in our deal with the devil and doubling up on some great damage items or something. Um, the one thing I'm not quite good at knowing with diplopia is like what items synergize with themselves and what items do not. Because there are items that picking up two of will do nothing with, so that in itself is a bizarre and interesting thing. Let's see. I know for, there are probably some people who are like, maybe you should have diplopiated uh, Poison Touch and gotten two on your way toward the Spun Transformation. However, it doesn't work like that. That is one of those things where they do not synergize with one another. Um, if you pick up two Poison Touches, you're not going to get... Can I jail free card? Hey, could have used that uh, a while back. Anyway, it's one of those things where picking up two Poison Touches does not get you two steps closer, unfortunately. All right, let's keep moving. We should try and use maybe our orbital a little bit more. And we have five keys. We have no reason not to pop it open. Uh, but just to speed it along. Okay. Let's see if we can make this work. Do not take a hit from the champion at the very least. Burning basement, you know, because our stats are decent, actually not being that much of an issue, which is nice. And that was decent orbital usage. Northern Lion would be proud. Come on, through the door. And I'm feeling confident, man. I don't know if I should be, but I am. I'm feeling very confident. Suddenly the dinglets are taking more than a hit. Their health is scaled, as is expected. All right, 
What do we got in our item room? It's really bad and not worth taking a hit over, basically. I mean, we could buy a bomb for five cents and pick it up, but I still don't think Stranger Tractor is worth it. Actually, though, buying a bomb and bombing this Tinted Rock could pay out. So I'm going to take this bomb, and I am going to bomb this Tinted Rock. It could be like a small rock or something. Who knows? It is not a small rock. However, a Spirit Art is still worth five cents. There was a higher chance of it paying out with something that would be more than five cents. Like if it was, for instance, okay. Uh, for instance, if it was like two keys or two spirit hearts, that would be good. I'm going to take it. I don't know if I want to, but I'm going to take it. And we're going to get fucking Krampus. We're getting a Krampus fight right away. All right, well, that is nonsense, game. Okay, stop taking damage, Mathis. Let's get in there. I'm going to take it, but I'm not going to Diplopia it. <laughs> I don't want to. It's not worth it for me. Might have been able to Diplopia that pedestal and kind of deal with the devil item, but I'm holding out hope, man. I'm holding out hope for the greatest Diplopia I've ever, I've ever done in my life. So we'll see if it ends up happening. Fingers crossed. I hope it does. Okay. All right. That's fine. Those guys require a lot of concentration when you have these guys around forcing you to dodge in very particular ways. And then those guys showing up. And we're back to nine cents, actually. That's pretty good. Curse of the Unknown or the Lost or the Maze or whatever this one is. I can never remember because they all vaguely can mean the same thing. Uh, it's not Curse of the Maze. I know that. It's Curse of the Lost, I think. Uh, it's, an it's annoying is what was I was I was getting at there, by the way, in case you were curious. Um... Yeah, we need some damage, man. I would love to get a little bit of damage up in this run. And by love, I mean, like, really would appreciate it. Will I reroll my run? I'm gonna go into the room really regardless, but will I reroll my run? I don't have to? That's the pedestals, I think? I can never remember. I know what six and one do, and that's about it, and five. I know what five does as well. All right, you know what? We're gonna fight our boss. And hope for a deal with the devil that is actually going to show up. That would be... That would just be the, the diddly darndest best. I don't want to fight this guy. I hate the stain. Alright, we'll just, just kind of play the dodging game. Alright. Okay, I got hit. Because I'm bad. Don't get hit now. Come on, die, 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 die. Okay. No deal with the devil. Krampus says prevented us from getting another deal with the devil. And that is where, uh, that's who I'm blaming. Regardless, regardless of, it's, if, of if it's true or not. RoboBaby 2.0. Oh, the game is going to be trying me so hard today. I'm going to go down to the next floor and just say fuck this floor. The shop's not worth it. I'm not going to wander around aimlessly not knowing where I am. Fuck it. It's not worth my time. Could be missing out on something great, but my patience with those types of floors wears thin. I'll say, ah, almost bombed a key. I only have two. If I can get maybe another key or two, then I'll do it. Maybe two keys because I think the shop is going to be something we can definitely make work on this floor. Only need a few more cents to really have it kind of kick off. I think we're going to start heavily relying more and more on our orbital as we start to see our damage not do much in general uh, here which is a shame because you know we had a really good kind of solid start not necessarily damage wise but just us from a run perspective we had some good items maybe you know I should have taken the book of revelations and that's where it all went wrong uh, I wouldn't be surprised if that's where it ends up going all wrong for us but I had to try I had to really try and pull out, uh, like, an incredible Diplopia. And maybe, the, you know, this is, like, the game trying me even harder. Like, hey, man, we're going to reward you. You hear me? You just hold out. We're going to reward you if you can prove yourself worthy of the Isaac name. And uh, hold that Diplopia for for a little while and, and get through some of the harder floors. And I'll be like, all right, game. I see you. If they give me a deal with the angel, though. Okay, like, there's, what was I supposed to do there? If they give me a deal with the angel, though, I'm going to be mad about it. Because, what the hell? Okay. 
kill you. Ah, fuck. I'm not, I'm not gonna be happy if I lose my deal with the devil chance, I'm not. Oh shit. Monstro's lung. I'm taking it, dude. I don't even care. I don't think, I don't even know, like, double Monstro's lung really fucking matter at this point. Alright, here's what we're doing. Nothing, because I don't have enough money or bombs to do anything. So I'm just gonna play the safe game, pick this up. Monstro's lung could be great. Our tier stat was actually pretty good, so Monstro's Lung was actually a decent pickup for us. Would love to go to the curse room. Not not really worth it for me right now, unfortunately. Okay, he gave me a black heart. Thank you, Poison Touch, for actually giving me... Oh, my God. Giving me back what was rightfully mine. A.K.A. my own health. If I can get a way to get, like... Give me Unicorn Stump. I would happily replace my current spacebar item. I'm an idiot. Why? Why am I having a hard time, like... Parsing those rooms. Ugh. I'm mad at myself because I know I'm playing like shit. Still shaking off that. I've been away from Isaac for a while. Rust. That's for damn sure. Was really hoping for something not that. Not that would have been great. Okay, it's all right. It's gonna throw freaking shit at you. Okay. Oh, we made it through. And it was a dead end, unfortunately. But we did get a bomb. So that's something. Okay. Uh, was really hoping for, like, a balls of steel pill or something. You know, when you're in trouble, do what you gotta do. Alright, let's go fight our boss and hope. Alright, it's not that difficult of a boss. We're gonna go over here. Have him chase us over this way. Okay. I don't know if you realize, dude, but the room was already dark. We did get a deal with the angel. Of course we did, because that's just how it works. <sighs> Fucking hate you. I hate you so much. I hate you so much, game! Why? Why you gotta be like that? God damn it, man! All right, well, we have enough items, uh, enough health to go into these curse rooms. Hopefully, like, a red chest will teleport us to a deal with the devil or something. That's all I can hope for at this point. I had to itch my nose. Sorry. All right, this could be all right. We'll see what this rune is. Burkano kind of sucks. The lovers, like, actual trash. I'm going to keep the get out of jail free card because at least it'll pop me out of uh, or open a door. That we desperately need. Hell, it could. If we wanted to fight Mega Satan, if we just hang on to it long enough, it'll be a Mega Satan killer for us. Which would be not really all that worth it, but hey. Also, apparently, I didn't kill him fast enough with my ball bandages. And who knows, man? Maybe the ball bandages would have been level 3 bandage girl at this point, and I wouldn't have to worry about this nonsense. But here I am, worrying about it because I'm an idiot, and that's just how I play games. I'm going in here. Okay. At least we're killing these assholes in one go. Well, apparently only the champions. These guys are a little bit more uh, fighty than the champions themselves, which surprises me that I can't just one-shot the normal assholes. We still alive? Okay, one is still alive. Yeah, again, for some reason he lasted. Tears down. One of the worst pickups we could hope for. No question about that. Let him run by it, skim it himself. Okay. No more jumping for any of you. My charge time is just not good anymore. I can't see jack shit, so I'm just gonna move. Fuck it. Okay, even if they teleported me out. Big fucking deal at this point. I already got what I wanted out of the room. This is a shitty room with shitty enemies. A shitty room with shitty enemies. Just last, man. All you gotta do is last. I know you tell that to yourself a lot for a many great deal of things, but it, it's. It, I mean it this time. Just last. 99 bombs. Alright. It's something. Bomb synergies. Bomb damage. You wanna give me a bomb run? I'll do it. 
I'll absolutely do it. Bomb runs are fun, man. Just let me let me have that. Give that run to me. Why am I still hanging on to the death card? Okay, let's just try and kill you. I have bombs, 99 of them in fact. So let's just use them. All right. Yeah, we're gonna take those more options. And leave. We have 99 bombs actually, hang on. Let's bomb you. Secret room, but really, I want that. We could have picked up the reroll. And we might pick up the reroll now. Um, yeah, we'll have the money for it. Worth it though? I don't know. I'm gonna put this death card away. I don't know where, it, oh, it's back one extra room. Fuck it. Keeping the death card apparently. You know what, F this room. And everything it stands Justice. for. Justice is fine. It's just, it's just get out of jail free. It doesn't really matter that much. I know Mega Satan, but I'm not gonna lie to you. Mega Satan run just, not looking likely. Let's put it that way. Uh, I mean, flight is great. I'll take flight happily. Sure. In case we need some more cashola, I guess. Have we gone to the item room? We have. Ah, the sun card is a great pickup here. Well worth ditching get out of jail free for in every situation. Come on. Come on, there we go. Yeah, I know, daddy loves you. You know else loves you? Your mom, she's a nice lady. Okay, let's go fight the boss. Pop the lover's card because it's pointless. Please, deal with the devil, deal with the angel with an item in it. Like, any of the above would be I ideal in general. I don't have a lot of speed here, so. Okay, I don't know where you're shooting down there because I wasn't anywhere near that. Alright. Okay, he's dead. Ah, a deal with the devil. I'm gonna leave that for a second here. You know what? I'm keeping, I'm keeping Diplopia. I'm keeping it, I don't care. I'm fucking keeping it, let's go. However, we finally did make a deal with the devil. We have more opportunities. We've already fought Krampus now. Like we have more opportunities for a deal. Let's just make this work, man. Oh, where is he? Oh, he's, he's stealthed. Eat shit, I'm gonna just walk into you. Bombs are key. Um, you know what? I'll take it. Pyro became skeleton key, essentially. It's not terrible. It's not great. It almost doesn't really matter all that much. I think the keys in the long run are better for us, but it means like I can pop open everything now. Like, Without prejudice. Just everything that comes my way. Just pop it on open. Alright, there is the mom fight. I don't want to fight mom quite yet. I really would like a speed upgrade, I think. Which would be good. What? Oh, oh, what? <laughs> I looked away over at my audio recording. Oh, well, you know what? Fuck it. Might as well throw away three keys. You know what? Fuck it. Four keys. I was looking at my audio to make sure all the peaks and stuff were do going well. And I thought I was going directly into a door below me. I was not. Um, you know, you don't get to spend keys often like that. So, I'm alright. Just throwing away four keys. You know, shows how rich I am. Just means I can't use another bombs or key pill at any point. Here, let's go. Give me money. Pay out, bitch. One more. Now, there we go, all right. Oh, now we got permanent Polaroid invincibility, I forgot. Oh, that was dumb. I didn't realize. All right, can we get like a better trinket or something? I mean, this is an incredibly good item. It just is, it's just a very, very, very good item. Um.
I'm thinking because I'm like, what do I do? I, I got, maybe I used a plopy on this floor regardless now. It's probably best for my sanity and my ability to like win the game. All right, let's go hermit. Let's go fight mom. Hopefully win in a minute. Uh, boss rush, steal an item. And then hermit out. If we can do it. I hope we can. Let's find out. We can also Diplopia everything in Boss Rush. That is also an option for us. Okay. I think we're going to be fine. This might be it. Okay. Why don't we pick up the negative? Because we already have the, the Polaroid. We do not Diplopia any of that trash. We come in here. This is not worth diplopia-ing. Whatever. Hermit. Let's deposit some cash. Man, that was our that was our diplopia right there, and it was just not worth it. So hopefully the next deal with the devil is worth it or something. It's gonna deposit as much money as I possibly can. It's going to take as all of it, which is fine, because I beat the hell out of this thing for a, a many, many episodes. Well, if we hold on to the Palopia all the way to the chest, it'll end up being uh, worth it. Here, take the last penny I've got. And that was exactly how much you wanted out of me, huh? You feel good about yourself after that? Huh? Taking every penny I got and then saying, you know what I don't want anymore? You're a dick. That's all I can say. All right, we're going to go over this way. Into the item room, bomb our way into uh, the uh, the curse room here. I don't need the key, clearly, but okay. Not really what I was looking for, but I guess more money is welcome. And thank you, Tinted Rock. All right, I don't need that apparently. If I had taken that D6 shard, I could have re-rolled the deal with the devil. But I didn't. I maybe beat myself up a little bit over it. But I shouldn't be. There's no way to know. Justice. Pretty fly. I'll take it. It's a good pickup. Uh... Another orbital, I guess? Not that we need to go anywhere near Beelzebub, but it's still another orbital. All right, well, let's get out of here. Slowly walk our asses out. It was a decent floor. We have a strangely underpowered, I'd say underpowered. It's not, maybe underpowered is the wrong term, but a strangely meh run. Slightly average, I guess? Like, we're doing okay. So clearly, maybe underpowered is not the right term. But it's like a we Like, it's like all items that just have no synergies with one another just kind of working separately from one another, but they're still together getting me through. I left my sun card, I'm realizing, unfortunately. Which is a sad time. But it's not like it was an emperor card or anything, so oh well. I think, honestly, like, maybe a speed upgrade would actually speed this along. Which I know sounds stupidly obvious, but if we could get a speed upgrade, I could approach enemies faster. I can move from room to room faster after we clear it. A lot of what's keeping this slow is just the fact that my character is just slow. It's just how he is. Good. I don't need the money, but I'm going to pick it up. You never know. I don't have infinite bombs anymore. Never really had infinite bombs. But you know what I mean. All right, bad damage. We got our health back from it, which is nice. Just dodge around. Okay. 
Thank you for dying. Took you 10 hundred years, but you did it. Exactly 10 hundred years. Uh, I don't know what I was hoping for out of that, but I'm going to take this because it, it'll give us an opportunity to be back at permanent Polaroid invincibility, which we didn't really have that opportunity because we were at a full red heart, so... It was beneficial. Was it worth a bomb? Mm, probably not. But... At this point, what are we using bombs for anyway? Tinted rocks that show up, maybe. Here, I'll grab this too. Alright. Ooh, ooh, alright, well... I got a spirit heart back, so... It ended up being a... A net neutral. I don't know why I wanted to take it, but I just had, like, the urge. And I'm just picking up red hearts. You guys are basically completely not a danger to me. Uh, what did we get hit there by? This guy? We must have. Alright, let's swing in here. I was hoping for the best. Didn't get the best. But we hoped for it, I'll tell you that much. I don't see any tinted rocks. Keep moving. Oh, shit. Okay. Thank you. Ball of bandages. See? If ball of bandages was level 3 bandage girl, that wouldn't have happened. I wouldn't have... Ha she wouldn't have saved me a little bit. There. Like they just did. Come on. Hello? You still alive? Unnecessary life. No life is unnecessary, Mathis. Sorry. Didn't mean it like that. Almost uh, going high there on, on the I'm on the money counter, which is nice, but we don't need it. I mean, I, I'm just gonna let him do all the work there. Good. So I like to see instant spidering of the baddies. Please deal with the devil. Please deal with the devil. We got one, and we got a tears up. Now's our time, friends. I don't know if it counts as, uh, I don't know if it counts as two guppy items, but I took it, and I feel great about it. Was that the best Diplopia this, this run? Not all game, this run. I'd make an argument and say probably. That was probably our best chance to get a very good Diplopia. I'm trying to think. I mean, the only other argument is we Diplopia, Bandage Girl, and we, uh, we kept it kept the um whatever you call it there book of revelations but we didn't and that's all right and i think i think this is a better outcome i really do i would argue that this is definitely a better outcome we got nice tears up some couple of damages ups and uh temperance huh and we got a a couple guppy items and i'm not entirely sure count but I got them, and does that mean I have like a, instead of a 50% chance of respawning when I die, I get like a 25% chance, or a 75% chance rather? That would be pretty sweet. I'd be into it. Oh, alright. Didn't know we had Curse of the Maze going on. Now right, we're going down then. Maybe the game is just trying to guide me. Which I appreciate. Game doesn't do it enough. Huh? Yeah, this is actually looking like it's the right way. I'm not gonna lie. And look at the damage. Look at the damage there. That's good. I'm liking it. Can't go in there. Okay, that's fine. Tiny room. Okay. Try again. Okay. There's a lot of lust around, I'll tell you that much. Lust is kind of everywhere right now. Did we make it? We made it, fam. This shit is lit. We're good, we're good, we're good. Whoo! Down, please. 
Boss room be down this way. It's not. Do we want to... Uh, I was like, do we want to try and fight for the, the right to party? Also, getting the angel statues? The answer to that question is fuck no. No, I do not. I have 99 keys, so fuck off with that nonsense. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay. This looks like it's going to be the right way. I sincerely hope it is. Okay, cool. I don't know why I picked that key up. And there's our boss fight. Alright, let's do this. Okay. Really? You're gonna still shoot eyeballs at me? Or summon eyeballs on me or whatever? I'm too slow. I was too slow, and I had to get hit there. And you're fucking diddling your own pickle if you think I'm going to fight the hush. I'm just saying. Not happening. No, sir. No way in hell. And look, everybody diddles their own pickle daily sometimes, but not, not, not for that. Nope. Get out of here. All right, Maya, we just went to the bathroom, everybody. Good job, Maya. Daddy's proud of you. Good, good. Yeah, I'm gonna take the damage. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take the stars and hope for, no, we just went back. It basically did what the fool did. It's fine. However, damage up is nice. Ooh, shiny, bright coin things, guys. Be ready. It's gonna happen. Do we get Guppy? We do not. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go ahead and... Okay. Good. Yeah, we've got a good run now, man. It's a little bit weird, but... It's a good run. I think we're probably at max health now, too. I did kind of double use Guppy's paw there. Full health. Full health. Thanks, buddy. I, is, I can never tell if Keeper's Head is actually, like, a good item, like, for damage-wise, or if it's just money. I think it is. It's got to be a minor damage up, right? Outside of, like, throwing cash my way all the damn time. Whenever I see it, I get excited. Probably for no good reason, but I do. Either way, we're doing good. We're really doing good damage here. All right. Uh, we'll go, I guess, up and left. It's one of those long layouts where no matter which way we go, it's going to be kind of awkward. We'll never really know which way is the right way. We have permanent Polaroid invincibility, which tells me we have, uh, we used up all of our red hearts. So Guppy's paw is going to be pointless for us. Okay. Dead end after dead end. I just want to get to the chest, man. I'm ready to be done with this floor. I hate, I hate this goddamn, the cathedral. It's basically hot trash. Okay. Okay, all right. I'll just run into you then. Trying to get some damage done. Can't pick up the red heart, so that's a good sign. Okay. You're dead. Don't get hit. Okay, you're still alive. Now you're dead. All right, Isaac, I'm, I'm coming for you at the slowest possible rate, but it's, I'm, it's it's happening. I'm here. I'm coming, buddy. Don't you worry. It's 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 gonna happen. Why use the world card here? It's a very good question. I hope you weren't expecting an answer because I don't have one. Okay. Thank you. We'll pick this up and then eat the heart immediately. Okay. Phase two. Can we get him to phase three really quickly? 
We were. We are still very slow, however. Okay. Oh, thanks for the penny. Give me, like, proptosis or something on the chest, man. Let's just speed this along, shall we? Down we go. Whew. All right. We'll eat this heart. No. Shit, 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 and shit. Okay. I don't think Cursed Eye does anything for us. I'm not going to pick it up. Well, when they go through multi-dimensional baby, we will say they do a quite amount, a quite an amount of damage. And if we can maybe use that, that would be good. If we could weaponize it, that would be great. I like how I hit him with so many bullets, it just stops him dead in his tracks. No, I'll keep the damage. I don't need safety scissors or whatever. I mean, it's all right to take that hit, I think. Not really worried that it's going to do us too too dirty. Another pointless room. Come get me. And not worth it. All right. Maya. You took a stinky poopy or something. Gross. I mean, I could take... You know what? I'm going to save... I was going to try and save him for last, but... It did not work. Double the virus. Double the fun. Double the peppermint gum. Alright, this is the... The run is over. Like, we're going to win. Uh, Bomber Boy's fun. If we had more bombs, really. Uh, what? what? Something happened there. Okay. Just trying to hope to get a little bit of poison shot out of him. Or, I mean, uh, not a poison shot, but a demon heart out of him, rather. Bombs are fine, but we don't need them. Alright, let's try not to die. We only have five hits in us right now. Just need to be very careful, and we'll be fine. There's a lot of bombs just everywhere right now. Alright. Good. Come on. Stop running. Oh, there's three more of you. Holy shit. Thought there was only the one. Should have looked at the health and realized it would be more than that, but I didn't. All right. What? How are you still alive? Die. God damn. Also, fuck in these goddamn big rooms, man. There's so many of them. I don't want to play the big rooms anymore. Why are you spinning around? Like you're having a good time. Okay, die. Don't need the key. Fucking hell, these big rooms. Kill me. I'm moving so fucking slow. You're dead. Just ran into him, apparently. Hey, thank you. Yeah, that'll help, actually. That spoonbender is always fun. Always a nice pickup. Okay. This is... Almost done, is what it is. Please be left. Looking maybe like it's gonna be the left. Okay, you're dead. The more I see, the more I like. Some more rooms like this, and I'll, I'll know I'm going the right way. You're dead. Okay. Is there a chest up there? Fuck this room. This room is usually one I can take out immediately. However, not this time. Is there a chest? Yes, there is. Okay. Sure. Shielded tears. Shielded Tears, rather. And there's our boss. Thank you for finally showing up. Let's end this. 
Alright. We'll just... I mean, we could tank you for the most part and be totally fine. I'm not even taking hits right now. Shield of Tear is doing their job. And you're dead. Well, thank you guys so much for watching for what was a really bizarre run. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, come back next time. More Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. And consider dropping a like. Your support means the world to me. And as always, I'll see all of you next time. Bye-bye.